if you're at the point where you've checked all your documents for any errors, you've done the pre-flight process, you've spell checked, then we can output to PDF for professional print. With a single document open inside of InDesign, you can go to File, Adobe PDF Presets, and from this list, choose PDFX 1A 2001. That is an exchange version of PDF that is built so that the print provider or the person that will turn your document into a printer publication has everything they need built into it. It'll then ask us where we wish to save this. So in my main Esquire folder, I'm going to go into exports and I'll name this document Esquire May underscore Pro Print. I'll go down to the bottom and then click on save, which takes us to the dialog box. From here, you'll need to make sure that export as it's set to pages and you're exporting every page that you wish to be in the final publication. Under compression, from here, it's going to check your document and if it finds any images that have a PPI of 450 or greater, it will downgrade them to the minimum that we need of 300 in an effort to save file size in the finished PDF. My suggestion would be swipe over that, change that to 310 for color and for grayscale images, just in case. But it's highly likely that everything's going to be a color image and it's very likely you'll get a smaller PDF file size. Under marks and bleeds, turn on all printers marks and turn on use document bleed settings. Under output, here, color conversion, it's going to check your document and if it finds any colors that are not CMYK, it will convert them to CMYK. Otherwise, it will leave them as they are. That's essentially what convert to destination, preserve numbers means. And then under destination, well, we need it to be CMYK document. So under here, coated Fogra 39 is an ISO standard, very common. But if you're asked to use a different printing profile, then pick one from the list or one that the print provider will ask you to use. And then from here, we're all done. You can go down to the bottom and click on export. 